dinner's about ready. I'm not hungry. Well, you mustn't feel left out because you don't have a boyfriend now. But I do have a boyfriend. Oh, you do? Oh, that's wonderful, Jan. What's his name? His name is George. I'll go wash up for dinner. I'm starved. <laughs> Hi, honey. How's the new boyfriend? Huh? George. Oh, George. Terrific. He's out of sight. Believe it or not, George isn't at home. Please leave a message at the beep. I must be out. Before I pick up the phone. Where could I be? <laughs> Believe it or not, I'm not home. The other girls were absolutely green with envy when this real cute boy started talking to me. <laughs> what boy, Gordon? Oh, Dad, I'm talking about Tommy. Well, you gotta have a computer to keep up with our boyfriends. <laughs> we forgot the pickles. Well, I'll get them. No, I'll go. <laughs> Believe it or not, George isn't at home. Please leave a message at the beep. I must be out, or I'd pick up the phone. Where could I be? <laughs> Believe it or not, I'm not home. Hey, where are the pickles? I guess we're out of them. <laughs> hey, I got another call coming in. I gotta let the machine get it. Bye. <laughs> Believe it or not, George isn't at home. Please leave a message at the beep. I must be out or I'd pick up the phone. Where could I be? <laughs> Believe it or not, I'm not home. For a minute ago, she was never going to eat again. Now she's starved and has a new boyfriend. Well, go figure out a woman, even her size. <laughs> Hello. Oh, hi, George. <laughs> oh, I guess you're not at home. Sure, I can talk. It's so sweet of you to call, George. Anyway, good to hear from you. Really looking forward to the ball. King George is back on the line. Oh, I'm still in the phone company. Boy, is he giving her the rush. <laughs>